Nissan Aria is part of Nissan's effort to expand its production of electric vehicles. The Aria will be next in line to the Leaf hatchback. The Nissan Aria is expected to offer a driving range of nearly 300 miles. To make sustainability one of its priorities, Toyota has launched a new model, BZ4X. It has been made according to the ETNGA philosophy to simultaneously deliver outstanding performance and practicality. Comparison between the performance of Aria and BZ4X Nissan derives its features from different cars, like the torque split system of the GTR sports car, which offers an all-wheel drive using a dual front and rear configuration of the electric motor. Aria can go from 0 miles per hour to 60 miles per hour in less than 5 seconds, which can be said to be worthy of notice. The front-wheel drive models will most likely probably be slower, but are likely to offer impressive acceleration despite it. The BZ4X, according to Toyota, has focused on safety-based performance. The range and battery life of the Aria and BZ4X The Venture Plus has the capacity of 300 miles driving range per charge. They evolve, and their Premier meanwhile offer 285 miles each. Then, there's a Platinum Plus, which is thought to be capable of doing 265 miles. The Nissan Aria can be charged at home with 110 or 240 volt outlets and public charging stations. They can even be charged with DC fast charging ports. The BZ4X has been made with practicality and sustainability in mind. It also has excellent battery retention, 90% even after a decade. The BZ4X can be charged using a DC power supply function that adheres to Japanese specifications. It can also be connected to power feeders. Interior and Comfort of the Aria and BZ4X Aria's interior has a futuristic as well as a minimalistic look. Nissan seems to have gotten rid of almost all buttons to try and create a smooth dashboard that has a sleek look and matches the design of its exterior. The Aria also comes with zero-gravity seats that ensure comfort at its best. The Toyota BZ4X comes with an extra cabin because of the BEV dedicated platform. It also has a cozy feeling due to the low instrument panel and the panoramic roof. It also consists of an upholstered instrument panel to create an interior with calm vibes. The soundproof glass and noise reduction functions make this vehicle a place where passengers can have conversations without being interrupted by external noise. The Aria's and the BZ4X's infotainment system comparison. The Nissan Aria will have dual 12.3-inch displays a dual gauge cluster, and an infotainment screen. It will also include features like Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and in-dash navigation. The BZ4X will come with cloud navigation that will use maps on the cloud to gather information about traffic and the availability of parking spaces efficiently. In addition to that, it will also include features like driving support, charging station display, and driving range display as options. That's not all. The BZ4X will have voice recognition features that will enable the user to operate wiper and air conditioning through the use of this feature. What is more, it will have OTA or wireless software updates over the air. This vehicle will also come with a digital key. That is, the BZ4X can be locked or unlocked with a smartphone. These digital keys can be given to family and friends to use and lend the vehicle. The Safety and Driver Assistant Features of the Aria and the BZ4X The Nissan Aria will come with ProPilot 2.0, the second ProPilot semi-autonomous technology. This makes it possible for EH drivers to take off their hands from the wheel during certain driving situations. The BZ4X comes with features that have strength and measures to prevent and detect any battery failures if they happen. Toyota has incorporated multiple monitoring systems that ensure safety and security in an emergency. It offers redundant battery voltage, current, and temperature monitoring to detect abnormal heating and prevent overheating. Fuel Economy of the Aria versus BZ4X there is no EPA fuel economy estimate available for the Aria yet, and neither are there any MPGE figures available as yet. The BZ4X comes with a roof solar panel that makes electricity that can drive for an 1,800-kilometer distance per year. The Warranty and Maintenance Coverage of Aria versus BZ4X 
It is thought that the Aria will include a basic warranty package like the Leaf. The warranty will have a policy that is bumper to bumper and additional battery protection that will last for almost 8 years or 100,000 miles in other words. The Aria will come with a limited warranty covering 3 years or 36,000 miles, a powertrain warranty covering 5 years or 60,000 miles, and no complimentary scheduled maintenance. Toyota says that it will guarantee to retain at least 70% of the battery life after doing 620,000 miles, which is approximately a million kilometers. All in all, it can be said that both the Aria and the BZ4X have good features. Each of the EVs, both the Aria and the BZ4X, has its strengths and weaknesses. It is indeed a close call. Both vehicles have much to offer, and the choice might depend solely on the buyer's investment and the specific options the buyer might be looking for. It might also rely purely on the preference of the buyer. All in all, it can be said that both the Aria and the BZ4X have much to offer in terms of performance, sustainability, and comfort. It is a close call to choose one over the other. It is no doubt that both these vehicles are awesome in their way and pave the way towards a sustainable future.